Okay, um, so I'm going to share with you about our range of uh, digital skills program. Um, first of all, just a little bit about us, right? Okay. Now, little we are a digital learning and a talent platform. Of course, for digital learning, it's quite easy to understand. But most people will ask me, what do we mean by talent platform? Are we a recruitment agency? Now, when we talk about talent platform, uh, we are really talking about connecting our learners or graduates to the industry. So for the last 10 years, we are not just doing training. We do a lot of train and place. For learners coming to us, we always try to help them to connect to the hiring companies out there. And so if a company is also looking for digital or IT talent, right, they can also come to us and get that inflow of local talents. Okay, so for those of you out there who are also looking for some IT or digital um, business talent, okay, feel free to approach us at no cost at all. All right. And for the last 10 years, we have been helping more than 20,000 learners and over 2,000 companies to upskill their staff as well in all the digital so-called skills that we offer. And this is broadly the range of the programs that we have. For deep tech programs, we have things like emerging technologies, like data science, AI, IoT, cloud computing. Uh, tech light will be more for business professionals, all right, who want to so-called gain those digital skills to function more um, than a traditional business role. So we have things like digital sales and marketing, business analytics, and digital workplace. So these are just, you know, broadly the range of programs that we offer. And of course, for most of the SSA, I think the important thing that will be of interest to you will be digital transformation. So in terms of digital transformation from Litton perspective, there are four areas that we need to look at. And I will share with you how these four areas, um, through our training, you can cover that gap. Now, first of all, we talk about digital engagement. Now, digital engagement is really about outreaching or marketing through all the digital platform or channel. And this is, this is key to a lot of so-called interaction, right, to your target audience because everyone is online right now. So we have our diploma in digital marketing and diploma in digital business, which is more towards business development. They can help your staff to gain the skills to do that. And then we move on to tech and able operation. Now, what we mean is that um, for business operation to be more effective, it's inevitable that we need to enlist software as a service, right? Business application, things like ERP or CRM. So we do have our diploma in professional services they can install your staff with the skills to implement such business tools um, in your organization. And of course, for a digital organization, right, for a digital transformation to be successful, we're all talking about being a data-driven environment. And data is key today. So how do you make better and smarter business decision through insights of data? So that's the reason why we also have a diploma in a data science and a business analytic program right, to equip your staff with the skills that they need, all right, to bring these insights from the data that's inputting to your companies every day. And modern workplace, this is what we are talking about, the backbone of the whole digital workplace, right? And there are three things that is important. First of all, process automation through RPA, robotic process automation. And then we are talking about also having remote collaboration, Right, like what we're doing right now, but more, okay? So how do you set up a remote collaboration environment where people can be worse apart and yet real-time in terms of communication and presentation, okay? And of course, we talk about data-driven environment. We also talk about, talking about data visualization. Everything that we present, everything that we want to propose will all be driven by data. So these are the backbone of a digital workplace and the programs, the training that enables that will be, of course, first of all, we do also have the skill feature for digital workplace for people who are pretty new to a digital environment. Our digital workplace program, the digital workplace bundle that you're seeing there actually contains the three things that I talk about, which is process automation, remote collaboration through things like uh, Microsoft Teams, Zoom, and much more. And of course, our uh, data visualization through tools like Microsoft Power BI, all right? And of course, for leaders in the company, if you want to transform your company digitally, we also have our innovation management program. 
So this program will train you how you can kickstart a digital transformation within your organization, how you can even incorporate technology implementation, okay? And how we train, um, we train via our learning innovation class. Class means competency learning as a service. Uh, we focus a lot on workplace outcome. And that's the reason why, of course, our curriculum are all competency-based, are all based on the jobs, the tasks that your staff actually perform in the actual workplace. And we understand that learning could be quite challenging in terms of time constraint and all that. So we do have blended learning. So people can learn through self-paced e-learning, um, flip class or mentoring session. And based on the current situation, we're talking about learning fully online through our online synchronous learning, whereby it's a virtual learning, but everything still happens in real time, you know, just like a physical environment, okay? And last but not least, the most important thing, work integrated applied learning. So what do we mean by that? Again, like what we shared, we focus a lot on workplace outcome. So the learning, right, um, we are not just going to stop at the classroom, but we're going to bring to the workplace as well. So in fact, what I'm trying to say here is that our trainer will integrate workplace implementation of the solution as part of the learning. So the trainer could be like our consultant who will look at whatever things you need to implement in the workplace, okay, train you and guide you to implement those so they can become self-sufficient to implement those technology. So that is what we're all about. A lot on the outcome, a lot on really bringing transformation to the workplace, not just in the classroom. All right. So with that, um, I shall pass the virtual mic back to NCSS.